Happy New Year! 10 seconds. Are you at 10 seconds already? 9, 8, 7, I'm on 10. 6, I'm barely on 5, 10. 9, 8. 4, 3. I'll see you on the other side, buddy. Oh, man. All right. Then definitely shut up while it plays. Oh! Strangers. Well, tell me what you think. The first. homies. <laughs> the homies. <laughs> tell me what you think first. Uh, did you like no, it? I don't know. I don't know. You know, I feel like, I feel like this is like a music video for like the Jackass Squad. Like the Jackass like Squad from Jackass. I feel like if they made like a, you know, like like a at really, the end or whatever. Yeah, like a really cute like I love you guys music video. I feel like I'm watching like yeah the end of Jackass. Like man, we were the you guys are my boys. <laughs> it's, it's cute. I think it's cute. So you like the song? Yeah, I like it. It's cute. In terms of like, you know, the vocals kind of hurt my ears how they did the vocals, but I mean, it's cool. It's like really like like piercing. Yeah. I, Tom was really uh kicking it up. <laughs> like sing, yeah. like sing singing. I was like, holy shit. I was like, what the fuck is he doing? But I mean, at least he I will say I liked it though. At least that it was a little, because the song never picked up. So at least he picked up a little bit, I guess. Yeah. I, I was a little. I think this cute. I was a little sad. Mark didn't uh, like. You know, he was just he was very somber the whole song. I yeah. I loved it, actually. <laughs> Like a you lot, loved it. yeah. But I also wonder if I, it's because the music video, like the music video, and then like yeah, they're in front of the music video is like the music video, and then just like the green screen, like and they're all like the past. Like I thought it was just gonna be parts of like other music videos at first, but then they show like you know some of the stuff from like their live show, like the the fuck sign, and then the that one where they're at the beach or whatever, and those are like. Those concerts are both really, on YouTube, so it's really neat that they're. I really like, you know, do I have to die to hear you miss me? Oh my god. You like that line? Yeah, that's a good, yeah. Yeah. I liked it. The hit's pretty good. Yeah, it's, I don't know. To me, it's this is a million times better than uh, edging and everything off a of nine in California, definitely, as well. I'm happy. Cute. Yeah. I mean, I'm still nervous about the album. <laughs> you know, like, but, and also, like, there's not going to be a music video for every song. I think the music video really sells me on the song. Like, I think without, if I just listened to the song, like, if we, we, if I waited for the album, which is what I kind of wanted to do, and just listen to the album, I feel like I would have, oh, that's, I like the song, but it's just, you know, I don't love it. I feel like the music video makes me love it more definitely and uh i was thinking a sad thought like dude imagine like the meaning this song like <laughs> when one of them passes now you know like oh that shit's gonna suck so bad damn yeah good song I also love this. 
Oh, the TRL? Or what part of it? Tom's feet. Oh, <laughs> his feet there. I was happy the, uh, I had to go ahead. I was a little nervous, like, about the music video, the way it started, and, like, Travis is kind of standing there. He looks like an action figure at first to me. Like, <laughs> yeah, he looks he so, look, like, looking like over Buzz, HD. Yeah, he looking like Buzz Lightyear. But it makes sense now why they look like that. It, yeah, it did look funny, even with Tom. Because I thought they were really in front of the Adams song, like, uh, you know, like, wall or whatever. I thought that maybe they redid it, but it's just a green screen. So I think yeah. that's why it's all so, what do you call it? And then it shows the 99 Warp Tour, the Vans, and it's really cool. I feel like I'm going through the video again right now, and I'm like just seeing the stuff. I didn't even realize they had the After, Night, After Midnight music video one in there. They had the down mm -hmm. one, Stay Together for the Kids. You know what I think, too, that makes me happy is I feel like they care with this, too, you know? I feel like they, at least the previous two albums, I feel like they just didn't care too much. They just kind of felt like making whatever pop punk, pop punk song. Yeah, well, yeah, it feels like they're doing it like for themselves rather than for just everyone to make, else. You know, so, yeah, I think that's, yeah, because that's how I feel like the other albums felt. Even Tom's... uh yeah, it's like, There's oh, I gotta demo. make a Blink album. Yeah, like, what, that's how I felt like Life Forms was. Like, Tom was trying to, like, you know, prove a point that he could still make kind of pop punky sound, but he, not fully gotta committing with it. make an album. Yeah, this one feels, yeah, this feels more like they're, they're getting genuine. Together and being like, yeah, let's make an album. Yeah. It's gonna be sick. And I think that was my problem with Edging, too, is, like, it doesn't sound good to me, and, like, at least uh, the mixing wise. And then, yeah, it just sounds like they're trying to prove a point like they can still do pop punk but this feels more genuine you know what i'm saying you know what i'm saying you know what i'm saying well good news good it's news the only song on the album that they cared about <laughs> or that we like no i'm sure <laughs> i mean there has to be i mean i like the anthem part three and then the you don't know what you've got like i'm sure i'll like more I think I think a thousand percent this album too is gonna be like I'm gonna like the majority of it, I think, but I think it's gonna be just okay. It's gonna be neighborhoods again for me, I think, where I just think it's okay. And then as time goes by, I fucking love it because I just keep listening to it. Because Tom, I think, just has that effect on me because I just like his voice so much and pretty much almost everything he's done where I didn't care about it too much. I've loved later on, except for the demos tape uh, that he did solo and life forms. I will not go back to those because I just think they're awful even for him. But like, like some of the angel stuff, like I didn't, wasn't ever too crazy about. And it's just something that grew on me, you know? So I think that's what this album will be. It'll be like neighborhoods. Neighborhoods is sick though. I mean, I think it is now, but I didn't think it was at first. I love neighborhoods. Yeah. I will say, I, I hope Mark picks up a little bit vo vocally. Like, this song makes sense, but, like, I feel like he's... I wonder if it's how his voice is now that they're, like... Oh, because of the cancer? It's, like, so... Mm. Yeah, it's Extreme. so, like, super, like... I don't know the word for it. I guess saturated mm. would be a good word. Like, they really had to mix his voice, it yeah. sounds like. I will say, too, that... I don't know. I, I, I just feel like a Tom Dick writer. Like, I feel like it fits better, Tom. Like, all that shit. Like, the... You know, just because his voice is that high. Like, or whatever. But Mark's, yeah, it does sound, like, a little more rough to me. I don't know why. I was talking about Mark. I was talking about Mark when I said the saturated. Well, that's what I'm talking about. Tom? I'm talking about both. I mean, you don't think both of them are kind of oversaturated? I just, I, I think, I think, I, I think th Tom sounds the best at the beginning. Hmm. 
But then I don't. I, when they sing together, I feel like they don't fit together. Mark like destroys his voice. That's why I'm like I hate to say I don't think he is. And again, I think it's because like what they were talking about, like when he said it too, where he had to like basically go through vocal training again just to be able to kind of like sing or whatever because of the treatment for his cancer. Um, where I hate like again saying it, but I feel like it almost feels like he's phoning it, phoning it in, you know. Yeah. But I don't think he is, and I think he obviously does care. I just like yeah. For the rest of the album, I hope he has a little more life in him. I guess you know, like I don't know, just to hear him sing with more energy would be nice. Yeah. But I mean, Wait, more I... than you know came out. What? Wait, it did. It's out right now on their channel. Oh my god! All right, are we listening to, <laughs> to this one? <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right, hang on. All right. Double whammy. All right, I'm on. You want to start at the same time? Okay. Countdown. Three. On go though. Two, one, go. <laughs> More than you know. So what do you think about that one? I like it less. Same. <laughs> <laughs> hey, and every every compliment like I gave him on the last song, it just like, you know it just <laughs> it went back and like just took it back. Like I was like, Oh no. Like it's not awful. It's not bad at all. It's just It's cool. It's it just doesn't sound great. And I feel like Mark's gonna um... do this like see, the way he's singing like, and what the fuck do his lyrics exactly mean? <laughs> like, I was gonna say it's like it's like Tom's trying to come in on nine. <laughs> yeah, I, that's what I feel and like. Mark is like, still on. Like, you know, he's still. And then the, and then the instrumentals are like, it's like it doesn't doesn't really fit. Yeah, it just it didn't do anything for and me. And Tom's coming in with the crazy shit, and then Mark's like. Yeah. Yeah, he yeah. Like it's just a mix <laughs> man. Like it's too calm and then it's too much. Or it's just like I don't know, it needs to be one or the other, I feel like, and it's just I don't know. I didn't I didn't Yeah, again it's not bad. And then the mixing is kinda, you know, it's like uh, uh, uh. I wonder if they're gonna repost it because that that fuck up at the start. Yeah. just very you know it's also oh, i, I want to cross my face yeah i do like the only line i liked was the uh uh well i don't know if i like it but the best line what were, they, what were you saying i don't feel pain but i feel more than you'd ever know and what was the other one i feel uh You know, what I was gonna say is that the ri writing on this song specifically reminds me of, like, the Sum Forty One demos that we were listening to like yesterday or two days ago or whatever, where uh -huh. it sounds very demo-y, like to me. Like, yeah, I wish, it doesn't sound I, finished. Yeah, I wish the lyrics were better. And I hate saying that because Tom, I mean, Mark, well, both of them, like, I, I love their songwriting, but it just doesn't feel like, like. Well, their vocals are drowned out. 
Well, not even their vocals, too. just the, like, I, like, I could maybe forgive the vocals if the lyrics were better. Like, the, like, this part, I'm like, what the fuck, dude? I shook all the leaves. Yeah, and left, dude, like, I was trying not to um, laugh. Like, come on, bro. <laughs> like, what is that? I don't know. It's just very... Left you with nothing, man. Yeah. I don't know. It's just, it's very, it sounds like settling on the lyrics because they couldn't think of something better to write. He shook all the leaves from my tree and left me with nothing on the song, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And I think that's, like, the issue, too, is, like, because the music isn't that great, it's just kind of middling, and then the lyrics, like, just suck. <laughs> All you say they suck, at least to me. You know, so it's just... It doesn't save it. So something... I don't know. Uh, I wish they didn't release that one. I wanted. I would have rather just listen. I'm scared. See now, I'm. I mean, I'm still scared. But the one more time song gave me a little bit of hope. But now it's just like, yeah. One more time. One more time. But yeah, now I'm worried. Do I have like... to die to hear you miss me? That's it. That's all I like from this album. Yeah, I mean, confirming it. I wanna let me let me look up the uh... that one line. Blink one eighty two one more time track one more line list one more line yeah. so it's got so I'm also hoping that that because I don't remember seeing that one on it is on the album God damn it it's track six I was like I don't remember seeing more than you know on the track list so I'm hoping maybe that was just like a B side single or something that isn't on the album that would have been sick as fuck. But no, it's not on the album. But yeah, so it's got Anthem Part Three, Dance with Me, Fell in Love, Terrified. I'm interested in Fell in Love because uh oh, and it says right here, too. Like people were looking at the credits, and apparently Robert Smith, you know the guy, the, the vocalist on all of this, you know. Hello. Mm-hmm. Hi. What's He's, up? I was, like, I was waiting for you to. Oh, the the vocalist. But I asked you a question. You know what I'm saying? You didn't answer. Okay. But oh the, shit! Uh, I'm sorry. Yeah, I was saying the you know the guy from all of this, the vocalist Robert Smith. Yeah, right? yeah. The... He's he's uh gonna be in. He's on one of the songs, like I guess as like he's credited, so he's gonna be on a track, as well as uh Tim Armstrong, the guy from the you know the bark the uh the, you know the dude from Rancid. And uh, yeah. he's on that one boxcar racer song, Cat Like Thief. He's gonna oh, be got features on this album. Yeah, he's so I think it's just them two. That is. It cool. looks like. Oh, you don't know what you've got. This has someone named Michael Polak. But I don't know if he is. He's just written like songs all the him. songs that are like low tempo are gonna be the the better ones. Mm -hmm. I'm interested too. Another one of uh, when we were young, because uh, you know how they have that one on the EP. When I was young, so when I was young and when we were young, I'm curious. And the dance with me song is on here, so I'm curious if that is going to be like the boxcar song, but you know, Blink rendition. Yeah. Oh shit! They released another one on their channel. You're lying to me. I am. <laughs> 